Welcome to Prayer and Coffee on this Wednesday. Isaiah 58, 6. Is not this the fast that I have chosen? To loose the bonds of wickedness, to undo the heavy burdens, to let the oppressed go free, and that you break every yoke. That's what Jesus did in Mark 9 for a demon-oppressed boy. Mark 9, 25. He rebuked the unclean spirit, saying to it, Deaf and dumb spirit, I command you, Come out of him and enter him no more. And when the disciples asked why their prayers had not been effective in helping this boy, he said to them, This kind can come out by nothing but prayer and fasting. So that's what we're doing. We're in prayer and fasting today for victory in spiritual battles this year. John 16, verse 33. These things I have spoken to you that in me you may have peace. In the world you will have tribulation, but be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. Jesus said that, declared that. I don't know about you, but I would like to see a great victory in spiritual battles this year. Miraculous victories against the spiritual host of wickedness this year. In Romans 8, 37, Yet in all these things we are more than conquerors through Him who loved us. In everything that we're still facing that's left over from last year, and everything that we will face in this new year, we are more than conquerors through Jesus Christ who loved us. Ephesians 6, For we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this age, against spiritual hosts of wickedness in the heavenly places. Therefore, take up the whole armor of God, that you may be able to withstand in the evil day, and having done all, to stand. Let's pray. Lord Jesus, we stand in the victory of the cross. You defeated the forces of darkness with your sacrifice and your resurrection We pray, Lord, give us victory and favor in every spiritual battle that we face this year. Bring us through every battle victorious. You said the gates of hell shall not prevail against your church. And we stand on that promise today and for all of this year. Jesus, give us a victory that takes back what the enemy has stolen from us in the past year and other years. Lord, we pray that a victory that rescues those who have been snared by the devil to do his will. A victory that gains ground against the enemy of our souls. Be our sword and shield in every battle. In the name of the captain of the host of heaven, Jesus Christ, amen.